So the video said she doesn't know Fina and the girl the vets, just the pie everywhere. Who be Fina? Because even me, I don't know Fina. Who be Fina? See, the way some of these people feel that because they are popular or because they, they did something, they became they famous or they went viral or because they appeared on a reality TV show, everyone on earth, everyone in Nigeria supposed to know you. It's actually very funny. It's really, really funny. Who be Fina big? What did she do? After Big Brother Nigeria and the money she collected, what is she doing that is adding value to Nigeria? What is she doing that is giving that name, that, that sustenance? Big Brother Nigeria don't pass. Let's talk about now. Waiting Fina to do. If you know waiting Fina to do, tell me. I'm not a celebrity like Davido, but I don't know Fina. If I walk up path for her like this and Fina stand, I know no say that she be that. So who is she feeling like? Like this all matter. I don't know. Okay, for people that do not know waiting up, they made a post and said like the people that like Fina are actually one of the most dumb people on social media. I think that's what the guy So Fina found out that the video liked the post and she went on to say something like, wait till I do the video. The hatred is real. And at the end of the day, she ended up saying, congratulations on your twin. The video came and replied the post like, it's an only mistake. I don't know Fina. Now where the wall has So stopped. this whole brouhaha has been happening. And some friends came up trying to like, make the girl feel good. I know Fina. My only while I be say, Straight bullet don't go touch Tasha. <laughs> because Tasha also came and said she know Fina. I just don't like the way they're dragging Tasha into this whole thing. Okay, <laughs> this is actually what happened. Immediately she made this tweet. Someone came and said, you having the videos tattooed in your chest and tweeting this is funny to me. And the video came and replied the, the irony. So after that, I think a lot of people have been making tweets and according to Tasha, the video has been going about liking every tweet that is made about her so she came out to explain the link between the tattoo she made about the video that time and how it brought her to where she is today and why she made that tweet in support of fina at least she's a woman so woman supporting woman but i just like the way she gave their own explanation and it's so beautiful please look at it an honest mistake was made you say it's an honest mistake and i understand how messed up twitter is now they bring a lot of nonsense to your timeline what you're not interested in seeing people you follow you don't follow i understand how messed up twitter is now but you made an honest mistake you don't make an honest mistake apologize and then still try to bring that person down it's just like say you they drive for road you hit person you can't tell person i ah, sorry you but why you say for car for this road you suppose they your house if you apologize and apologize you don't apologize and set somebody up for more drugs considering that you're a celebrity you understand what goes on you know how online bullying is you know people attack people unprovoked it was still the same social media ay made a joke an honest joke that some people found funny, some people didn't find funny. But at the end of the day, he came out and he apologized with how big AY is. He came out and he apologized. You even dropped the comment and everybody was happy and all smiling. You keep it moving. You apologize, you keep it moving. Or you don't want to say nothing. You totally ignore it. Or even casually quoting it with, ah, babes, no begs, I beg. It was just an honest mistake. And everybody laughs about it. But then you saying it's an honest mistake and then tagging it with, I don't know you. It, how does that sound to you? And at the end of the day, I tweeted and I said, Fina, I know you. We plenty, we know you. This is me supporting a fellow friend. This is me supporting a fellow woman. And at the end of the day, you start liking shady tweets about me. Like I want to understand how me supporting a fellow human being is me shading you because that was not the case. I wasn't trying to directly or indirectly shade anybody. I was only trying to uplift this woman up. And then you go about liking shady tweets about me. See, for anybody that cares to listen, right? For everything I've done from five years ago, from four years ago, from six years ago, if those years were to replay back, I'll do all of those things with zero regrets. Because everything I did in the past is the reason why I'm the person that I am today. It's the reason why Tatcha is who she is today. It's funny how anybody would think they can throw me. Like, you would throw me with pictures I posted. You would throw me with videos I posted. You would throw me for real. <laughs> that Tatcha then is the reason why you're not the Tatcha of now. Apologize and keep it going. So you people are trying to tell me now that some people are bigger than criticism. This is the reason why some people are exempted from certain things. There are some people that cannot be touched 
because they are up there. I'm sorry, you are not God. Oh no, don't say anything. And then we are in the country that we are in and then we keep complaining, forgetting that this, this society is a big reflection of ourselves, of we, we ourselves. We make the society. Nobody is above criticism. Not the president, not anybody. You, David, you are supposed to be the front runner against bullying because you know how it feels. People drag you for no reason. You know how it feels. By the end of the day, Shami, I thank God. Say, God that is in heaven, no be man. Yes, I don't beg for deals. I don't beg people to feed. I'm not in nobody's bed. I am who I am because I am who I am. And that's not going to change. I'm contented with what I have. I'm good. That's not going to change. This world is already hard enough. This world is already cruel enough. Country already hard. So any given opportunity that the way we go fit, take spread love. Show kindness, be kind to one another, irrespective of whoever it is, whether it's Fina, whether it's anybody, whether it's Tatcha, whether it's anybody. Make with it try to spread love. Let's not be hypocrites. Eh? Let's not be hypocrites. Let's not spread love selectively. Let's not share kindness selectively. Nah. At the end of the day, Sha, it's all over life. Well, Tatcha, I don't hear you, Sha. I don't hear your preaching. It makes sense. Yeah, we are supposed to love each other, spread love, not being selective and all of that. But again, we'll be Fina. Chichi talk say, no, no, Fina. So you are talking about Fina. What, what's Fina? What's that? Who's that? Who's that? Do, what do you know anybody named Fina? What's, what's so the So you're talking say? about Fina. Who's Fina? That's a person who followed the BB in a job. The video talks, you know, no, Fina. Me, I don't know Fina. I'll be Fina. We made the girl race a big.